Raids, the final frontier of gaming. Only the most elite and no-life players can possibly hope to clear such intense content. Well, actually, that's not true at all, and I'm going to prove it. I've assembled a team of 10 players with no experience in raids and also happen to have real lives. Together, we shall demolish everything from the entry-level strike missions all the way through to the ultimate Guild Wars 2 encounter, Harvest Temple Challenge Mode. Welcome to the Guild Wars 2 Boot Camp. Okay, team. It's time. Boot Camp. Prepare yourselves. We will do this challenge mode with nine players. We will actually... Oh, you know what we should do? We should sell this to someone. Yes! Oh, God. Yeah, yeah. What? What? How much do we yeah. ask? <laughs> I actually don't know what the price gold is. gold is about right. Yeah, I don't know so what the price is for this, actually. Um, <laughs> you know... Okay, check this out. This is fun. Check this out. When um, Zara came out, you know, Wing 3, we did that last time, right? When Wing 3 came out... I sold that the next day after we cleared it for 1,000 gold. Holy shit. Yeah. Back then, we were making money hand over foot. Seriously, it was actually ridiculous. Like, do you know what really happened? This is so funny. Do you know what happened to uh, the did, raids? Why did people pay 1,000 gold for that? Because uh, back then, nuts? raiding was way less accessible, to be honest. Because the game was a lot harder, and you, you just had to have certain builds, right? Like, I think this is something that's often very overlooked. Look, now we've got a ranger, a rev, a warrior, right? A necromancer, yeah. <laughs> a mesmer. Yeah. Back in the day, your squad was this. Two chronos, two druids, two warriors, and four ellies, right? Like that, <laughs> that was your raid comp, <laughs> right? And if you weren't play, if you didn't have exactly those builds, you were kind of at a disadvantage. There were definitely some other pretty decent builds, like Reaper was actually a bit, uh, quite good actually. But overall, the comp was very, Wait, was very that, um, rigid, right? With the, the way that you could approach it. Banner warrior, Aaron? Uh, that was phalanx strength um, warrior, uh. so yeah. Uh, but yeah, it was it was like old school warrior that generated like oh twenty five might right. That was what it was for. Um, Back when Chrono was the only spec with the lacrity. We could do maybe a, a bidding wars with Twitch chat. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I mean honestly, I think we should sell. You know, the Twitch chat could pay us to carry them through this, and therefore that could fund more gear and stuff like that for everyone. Right? That's actually big. Lovely. You know, if you think about it, though, that's huge. Like you know, we could essentially be selling runs while we wait to have ten and get a lot of profit out of that, you know, and, and that could yeah, be the huge. last time we had three just random pickups. We should have been charging them. That's true. For yeah. watching us. <laughs> yeah. Fail. Uh, okay. Stops, look, look at it. I'm actually leaking this. I'm leaking this right now from our 10th. Okay, check, check this out. I'm sorry. I partied unexpectedly hard this weekend. I need to relax a bit. <laughs> I, I'm serious. Oh, no. uh, this guy's out of control. I like this. This All guy's right. going to be fun. That's going to be fun. <laughs> right? Okay. Right. Okay. So this guy's unhinged. He's just going crazy, partying <laughs> hard. Okay, like <laughs> dude's out with the squad. Yeah. <laughs> and it's not us. Yeah. Uh, Sounds like a giga chat. Yeah, it's definitely a giga chat move. Yeah. <laughs> so I can't wait. I partied way too hard. Like <laughs> And I think that's enough. Actually, let's, let's get into this. Let's have a go. Um, so Cuspins, go ahead and take claim. Actually, uh, dispel doesn't actually matter who who takes dispel. Uh, it can be anyone. Well, um, range DPS, I guess. Yeah, range. Well, I mean, yeah, it, it's range. It's range anyway. Like it's a range thing. Um, but it, yeah, it but could be the, anyone. Give it to a player who's dealing with this. Yeah, so yeah, that's right. that's perfectly acceptable. I think. And then someone takes protect. I will not be taking anything. I'm not helping. You know, I'm uh, I am only an observer. Well, Kev, don't start it yet. Do it. Oh, okay, we're going. Look alive. Okay, yeah, <laughs> yeah. It starts the fight when we go. <laughs> so let's do this. Wait, do we have ever? Okay, we actually have everyone here. Let's go. And also, yeah, one thing here, cousins, try and keep the boss as close to the center as you possibly can. Right. So like, yeah. Right in the middle. Uh, yeah, yeah. And now you can start claiming, by the way. Start claiming. Uh, so claim square and heart. The first blue... No, don't move. Don't jiggle. Don't jiggle. Um, the first blue is going to come up in five seconds. Do we enable the CM, actually? Oh, uh, we did. Okay, good. Get in the blue. Get in the blue. Look where the blue tile is and get in. No one died. Big. Okay, kill all the ads. Kill all the ads. So claim them all done. And then spikes. Get the hell out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Just run. Just run. And again, just try not to move a lot of the time. Like, come back to the middle and just stand still, basically. Okay, blue. Get in the blue. Blue, 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 blue. Okay, we did not make that one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Uh, okay. Uh, do, do we lose reset? just... Oh, yeah, we, we reset. But, I, okay, good news. We've basically kind of seen how this works, right? Um, so, yeah, that's it. Okay. 
Blue. Go in blue. Nice. Get in those blues. Oh, yeah, really make sure ma uh, you got to make dead. sure that you're really in there. Like, don't uh, don't be like a little bit in. Be fully in. Reset. Uh, let's just go ahead and kill this ad. Can we get a dispel on that? Yeah, it's not cool down. Okay, good. Move, move, move. Out of the spikes. Move out of the spikes. Okay, and now DPS, take it down. It will explode when it dies. Get ready to dodge. It's exploding. Dodge. And then blue. Get in blue. Get in blue. Get in blue. Nice, we survived. We're gonna have two coming through, and th that's that's gonna be a bit intense. R you want only one of these alive at this at any given time, if you can possibly handle that. How do I manage? Cleave to them down. Send the protector on me, right? Well, just just basically at this point, just like uh, pull them on us, and we just try and brutally outheal this. To be honest, is uh, is what's gonna be happening here. But it's gonna be tricky. Uh, we need to try and res that. I'm gonna go for you. Use protect. Use protect if you got it. Use protect. Use protect. Uh, I got downed and did. You can so use it. Protect. Um, you can use it while uh, downstay. I think. Action keys like that are actually still there. They just, you just don't see the UI when you're in downstay. All right. Yeah. But yeah, That's really, it. really, really, really make sure that you are in the mix, right? Okay. Big heels now. Big heels. Big heels. Big heels. Let's go. It's exploding. So try and dodge that if you can. Spikes. And there'll be blue after these spikes. We haven't had an overlap yet, which is good news. Yeah. Okay, so here comes blue now. Oh, uh, okay, put protect in the middle. Put protect in the middle and go in your blue. Stand in the protect and go in the blue. Yeah. Oh, I didn't see the protect. Uh, you're too far away, yeah. I, yeah. Play, yeah. I placed it in the center. Yeah, I mean, it, it will always be placed. That was the correct placement. Um, so it's yeah, just that, just yeah, or, well, you don't, no, the, it wasn't exactly a mistimed situation. Bear in mind, the spikes won't kill you until they activate, um, neither will the blue, right? So you just need to basically trust the protect in that situation. Yeah. Uh, there's no more. Uh, I will actually there. do a little bit of a memory here. I have taken, yeah, I have taken the dispel. The overlap again yeah. within. Yeah, uh, th this is actually a really interesting situation, GG. So basically, um, You're too slow. If, if, uh, that's a, the, it, basically the pattern of the spikes changes every 25 percent so if you have a if you have certain dps numbers you can basically go into dps hell and the spikes and blues will always overlap this is kind of a fight where you actually tune your dps almost i think we would have been okay actually we just got that one overlap uh and then if everyone had survived i think we would have basically got through it uh but because our dps went down a lot because obviously quite a lot of people died we then got into their hell zone uh which obviously isn't uh, it's not ideal but kind of be ready for this um be aware of this that overlap will probably happen again right the first one that we had there right that will probably happen again <coughs> um so be ready okay go keep this up gamers try and kill that scout if we can Scout's down, it's exploding, dodge, and then move out of the spikes. Good, dispel the ad, dispel that ad, and kill the ad as well. Kill that one, kill the, okay, blue, 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 blue. And keep focusing down those things. Dodge out quickly here, dodge out fast. Ah, oh, that was a, that's a tragic protect waste, actually. Um, that might punish us. It's okay, sorry. we can, no, it's, it it's fine. Necessary. Move out, move out. Uh, try and kill this scout. Try and go all in on that scout to kill it. The one that I've targeted over there. The one that's nearly through. I need to fix my hotkey. I still don't have my hotkey set up, actually. It's really annoying. Nice. Very good job, Virtuotas. Get ready to move out to the edge, by the way. Gamers, after this set of spikes, we, go, we have to go out to the edge. It's after here. Get in the blues. Get in the blues. Just hold on. Okay, move out to the corner now. We're going to the corner. Everyone here with me? We need to claim this tile. Claim this tile. Good, good, good. All right, ooh, this is going to be fucking spicy. Um, try and kill this scout. Kill that scout. Move back in, move back in. Kill that scout. Kill that scout. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Don't let it through. Nice, we stopped it. Okay, we've got to deal with this ad. And it's 6%. Get ready to reclaim. Move, 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 move. Get over here, and then it's blue. Use every defensive you have. Yeah, blue is off the spikes there. I should have called that to be fair, but that's fine. Uh, reclaim, reclaim, reclaim. Move out of the spikes. You know... This is weirdly doable, but I do need you to oh attack. Oh god, Rev. it teleported into the fucking specs. Oh no. Yeah. Wait, oh, we only have a, we only have healers left. That's yeah. that's not ideal. Yeah, we GG, we're dead. Yeah. GG. Oh, our dispel just died. Yeah. Oh. Don't let that one through. Kill arrow, and then kill heart when it respawns. Out of the spikes, and then blue. Uh, you might want to protect that, actually. That's going to be fucked. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -oh. 
Yeah. <laughs> um, this is bad. We're dead. I think we're a bit dead. Reses, or? Yeah, I mean, we're we're <laughs> fucked. This is not looking good. <laughs> That's yeah. GG. Okay, GG. 18% dispel. Try, okay, uh, see the one I've marked with X? Try and insta-kill that one. When it respawns, insta-kill. We're gonna let the one that's further ahead through. Insta-kill X. Go, 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 go. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Let the other one through. Okay, good. Honestly, honestly that was quite good, actually. We probably could've killed both. This is after, going quickly after. Good. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay. It's fine, we can, we can hold this, we can hold this. Okay, we, we still have protect, correct? Yes. Okay, we're just gonna we're, we're gonna stay here. We're gonna stay here. Oh, we're gonna eat. The, yeah, 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 the, yeah, yeah. Center, okay, yeah, wait, wait. Gotcha. Okay, wait. Protect now. Protect now and stand in the protect. Be in the protect. Be in the protect. Just ignore the spikes. Kill the boss. Kill the boss. Go, go. Just kill. Nice. Just kill. Go, 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 go. Three percent easy. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Nice. We should have that. Yes. Got him. Ah, let's go. Good job, guys. Nice. There it is. Okay. Hype. That is. It's just a game. Mursad overseer. Easy mode. <laughs> Feels good. And look at that loot. You get a guarantee, and bear in mind, you get a guaranteed ascended from that. So this is really useful for us because obviously we're still in the gearing process. Um, so that's really do nice. Do you get it each time or do you get it just first time? Just first try, I'm afraid. Uh, but still pretty good. And you oh, get I a bunch of just, you know. Yeah. 10,000 point achievement. Ah, very good. Gold and Whoa! Gems. Oh yeah! Oh nice. yeah! You get paid. Yeah, ten k is big. Yeah, very nice. <laughs> Let's go. That's huge. We're getting rich. I like it. My inventory is actually full and. Oh, I'm just... really liking these chests, by the way. Oh yeah, the, yeah, these value. ones. Yeah, yeah, very big value. <laughs> you, I mean, if you want to get um kind of maximum value from them. What you can do is you can get the Ritz. Uh, I think, I'm not yeah. sure what's more expensive, like the Power Ritz or the Condi Ritz, and you I can just sell those. The, the Condi and the Power are pretty similar, but yeah. the Power ones insta sell for a little uh, bit less. Yeah, there you go. So yeah, you can you can do that and get some big value. Uh, that's for sure. Well done, team. Very, very, very well done. Uh, I love to see that. That was a good kill. We got there in the end, actually. We got the blast. We got the high value. And that's another pretty challenging oh, boss I down. Stickers. I got, got an ascended gloss. Yep. Oh. Let's go. Oh, very nice. So, um, we've got a few options here. Um, I actually think we can one-shot the next boss on normal mode. So that actually might be something we can do. I don't want to do... Okay, I'll actually give you the choice. Um, I don't think we're actually quite ready for Samrog challenge mode yet. I, I think we'd really have problems with that. So... Uh, two choices. We can either do it on normal mode, or we can get a little bit better, learn a bit more, practice a bit more, and continue the, you know, the wall run, right, of doing this wing entirely on challenge mode for the first time. Uh, I actually don't mind. Uh, I will leave the choice to you, boot Does anyone challenge have any you. strong preference? Challenge mode. You want challenge, challenge mode? mode. Challenge yeah, okay. Mode. Yeah, okay. Yeah, they're all for the ultimate challenge. This yeah. is easy mode. Okay, okay. I like it. I like it. It's not now. Not yeah. today. Jesus Christ. Not <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. For challenge mode. Let's go. Yeah. Easy. Uh, yeah, okay. Just, just straight up. I, I, we, we will not do it now. I like the conference though. That's a, that is Giga Chad. We won't do it now because I do think we need to prepare a little bit more. This is definitely a fight we want to come in uh, to fresh and um, have an understanding of like, you know, have kind of looked over a guide a little bit, have yeah. um, some strategy stuff kind of sorted out. And, and also, uh, I really want to emphasize this one. This is actually the first DPS check we're going to encounter. This guy kind of has a lot of health. Oh no, the, we're the, gonna get wrecked. Yeah, the, the next boss has 40 million health. Um, and a lot of, there's intermission phases that will slow us down a little bit. There's mechanics that will reduce your uptime and so on. And some pretty punishing stuff. Um, so I think right now we aren't quite ready to tackle this. That is obviously okay. Um, but yeah, we need to polish up on DPS a little bit. I need to get these slacker 8th and uh, 9th and 10th players in here as well. We've got to make that happening. <laughs> yeah. Right? Uh, it's big. Okay, this fight is going to be content. Oh. We're, we're, this is going to take a while. And I like that. This is going to be a grind. We will get through it though. I believe that we will survive. So run in pirate and and then we go in now we go in as well get in there. Let's go Get in quickly 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 really whoa look how slow that was we gotta be way snappier on that. Okay, also Apply these boons and you can you can just get in there. I'm hanging back guys because I got the mechanic also our tank instantly died That's not good uh, Good news is that lagnik is our other tank and also has the aggro now. You now have the aggro lagnik come and stand over oh, here oh, Yeah 
Oh. Yeah, you need to not get hit by that. You can jump okay. that, by the way. You can jump over that ability. Be aware. Okay, there's that. Okay. Use stability. Use stability. Okay, we should move move to the arrow here. Move to arrow. Limited. Move to arrow. Yeah, you can't stand in the giant red circles. Like, what? I thought you... Yeah. CC. Wait, what's up? No, you can't you stand in the... the markers. I was standing on the marker, and then the spear got me. I thought that's where the spears weren't going. Well, yeah, the markers are a vague indication. They're a va yeah, they're vaguely right. Oh. But you also just can't Ooh. stand in the... You can't stand in the giant red AoE. Like, you know, that's where we draw the line. Well, this isn't going that badly. Keep spamming stability. I have it, barely. Okay, good. That's fine. That's fine. Just move to squiggle. Yep, I'm liking this. Get to squiggle. Good. There's another defiance bar coming up. Keep this up, guys. We're doing really well here. Okay, now we're, we're actually gonna see this mechanic first time. Okay, now don't stand in front of the boss. He will charge the edge. Yep, oof. Yep, that's at six, six and 33. So now we have a combo mechanic. So we still have the spears. There are gonna be two adds that spawn. There are two adds that spawn now. So we've gotta kill both of these to proceed to the next phase. So here's the deal. We've gotta put, this is the most weird mechanic ever, right? We've gotta push Rigam under the boss. So we just got to push him over. So use any kind of push skill that you might have. And then we simply attack. Yeah, we're good to go. We're good to go. Now attack the big one. Good. So tank in position, by the way. Uh, tank. Oh, oh yeah. You actually got it. Big. Huge. Okay. You can go to squiggle. Go to squiggle and start tanking the boss don't, on squiggle. Don't, don't kill me. Yeah. Flower punk we're, save me. No, 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 flower punk did save you. You have been saved. Flower punk. Yes. Let's go. Right. Uh, defiance bar is going to be coming up soon. Oh, f oh, Omega. Omega. Go, 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 go. Really fast. Really fast. More, 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 more. Nice. Okay. Yeah, that was a bit spooky. Spears are getting eaten. Oh, um, it has been saved. Death, death flower. Yeah, I like that. Okay, move. To, if you're tanking, move to ab about star. Run to us. Everyone get back here. Run here. Just run here. Run here. You'll be, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. There's no shot we kill this first try, right? There's no, no fucking way. No way. Okay, good. We'll Jump that it. shockwave. Okay. We're, 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 good. we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, and then Mega CC is incoming. Oh, no, it's not, actually. It's 33%. Oh, Dude, nice. holy shit. This is going insanely well. So now we have that phase again. We have the, um, the thing. I'm stuck. Uh, yeah, 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 you're good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Cusbeans. Uh, you have to stand right on... Well, yeah. You want to stand a bit closer to that, Cusbeans. Yeah. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. It's all right. You can basically stand in each other's hitboxes. All right, so, um, come and stand over here so we can push Rigam in. Yeah. Okay, good, good, good. Push it. Yep, yeah, good. And then stay here. Hard to get a good angle with the spears. Uh, yeah, they're, they're despawning now, though. We have five minutes. Um, oh, oh, no! Oh, yeah, you're dead. Oh. Yeah, yeah. I was trying to get star five off on him. But well, yeah. Yeah, that's a little too clever. Star five is not a good ability to do that with. <laughs> <laughs> Do I charge myself into the spheres and die? Is that what happens? Yeah, that's exactly. Well, I mean, there's a lot of ticking damage, right? Yeah, you, you just you don't want to do that. Oh, uh, you flew too close to the sun and you're you're fucked. Okay, good. Just get back over here. Get back over. Ooh, that's not good. Um, we we want to get this. Okay, you guys go and CC. I'll handle the revive. Get this. Get the CC. Mega CC. I might get the tank here. That is fine. Okay, we got it, right? I think, uh, I think, wait, who got that? Ooh, that is Flower Punk. Flower Punk, go to Star. Go to Star. Okay, now uh, don't, now yeah. go to Squiggle. Go to Squiggle now. What is the Squiggle? I don't speak yeah. enough that, English. That's the Squiggle. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The, the, yeah, the, the spiral. Yeah, the light blue, what, light blue thing. Okay, good. Move over. Okay, now we want to move to Arrow. Move to Arrow. Move to Arrow. Yeah, good. Okay, good, good, good. We're good here. This is nice. This is nice. This is where we want to be. Okay. Okay. And use a teleport if you can. Use stability and you can just dodge through, guys. You can dodge through these spears. Just have stability. Uh, oh, I, that was actually me being very naughty there, actually. I'm badly positioned. That's fine. I actually might die here. No, I don't. Never punished. Actually, no, I did die. That's fine. Save me. I get you. Yeah. Uh, okay. Just CC. Uh, CC. Uh, CC. 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 Get the CC. Oh, what are you doing? Oh my ah, god. We no. we actually Yeah, we got it, we got it, we got it. Oh, I can't oh, believe this. We actually win. Don't, don't this is so joke, fucking funny. That is so yeah, funny. Yeah. Days, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I died there because I positioned my spear badly. You wanna be you wanna almost like bait the spears and I ignored that rule and I paid the price. Okay, good. Five percent. Kill! <laughs> okay, move to arrow, move to arrow. Oh my god. Samurok CM one shot. We've never seen the fight before. First try. Easy. You know, what was really what was what? what was really funny about this? I actually have to tell I've gotta say this. Oh, and I get seven and a half K AP for that. Oh my god, I'm looking good. Okay.
Here's funny about it. What's funny about this? Before I actually went live, I gave these guys a super serious talk saying we actually might not even kill this today. It's going to be the wall. <laughs> the brick wall is coming. Samurog, we will overcome the wall. You know? It's like, more unfair. Yeah. <laughs> I, g I gave myself mute because I really suck at my DPS. But mm -hmm. you mentioned this before, Teapot. You mentioned that we were good at executing mechanics. Yeah. But DPS wasn't that great. What's this fight about now that I've seen it? It's not about DPS, I don't think. Well, I, I actually think that the practice we did between last week and this week really helped. I think we're a lot higher on DPS, actually. You guys definitely put in the work, and, and that's huge. I definitely respect that a lot. Um, uh, it, it was we did some good. We did some good DPS. You can see that. Look, Lagnik is pumping now. Um, like pirates up there as well. Like Makama and Red are actually getting some pulling some numbers here. Uh, Reaper and Scourge also doing pretty well at the same time. Uh, Revs higher than last week. I, th I think people really put in the work. So I, I think that uh, last week we would have had difficulty with it, but this time, yeah. But I, I do actually, th look, I do want to actually say um, one thing is that, yeah, you guys are really good at listening, uh, as it turns out. Um, you you just do what I tell you to, and, and look, it actually worked! How crazy is that? Uh, well, the other thing I want to talk about here as well is that we adapted our build to the fight very well. Um, I think our composition is great. We have the revs. We have uh, Necro is actually really good here um, as well, obviously. Virtuoso is really good here. Uh, but we also took abilities. We took loads of CC, right? Most mechs would be here having fun elixir gun auto attacking instead of the glorious personal battering ram, right? Um, all that kind of good stuff. And, and that really, really helped us here as well. That's fantastic. Honestly, look, I think we can do Demos, actually. Let's go. I, let's, let's do Demos CM as well. I'm ready. I'm actually hyped. I'm hyped for this. Yeah, yeah honestly. Break. Okay. Oh, it's a Sam, straight in. Sam. Yeah, yeah, we're straight in. Yeah, yeah. On, yeah honestly, mm -hmm. Samuel wasn't that hard, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure why you were building it up so much. Is it like a pug kill or something? It, it's uh, yeah, pugs would fear that. I, I think it, I think it's yeah, weird actually. Good, it, good, it's because it's I have good. I've miscalculated uh, miscalculated the group. Um, uh, and what I mean by that is, I'm we, we're not super good at certain things yet because we're still practicing. But we're actually way above like really really good at other things, um, and that's actually massively compensating. So what we might we, we, our damage can be improved, and I think that um, our movement is a little sloppy here and there, but because of how responsive everyone is, that's actually an insane carry here, and I think I actually underestimated that a little bit. I also do, um, I'm also very cautious with people getting discouraged. Uh, one of the worst things that can happen is people get stressed and discouraged. So I want, I, I, I was definitely trying to set expectations that this would be a challenge that we'd have to work through because I didn't want you, especially with the, the challenge visit, I didn't want you guys to come into this and get discouraged that we didn't kill something. So I wanted to almost like set the tone. Yeah, this is going to be difficult. We might get a little bit stuck here, but that's okay. It's, it's hard. It's, we're supposed to get stuck. You know what I mean? Right? Um, yeah. Um Honestly, mm. I think I think it's that our main strength is that we're very good at listening. Yes. And we're good at doing mechanics, but we're not that good at like keyboarding and yes. like, technical skill. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I think a lot of credit yeah, goes to you as well, t -Bot. We're good at listening, but you're good at telling us yeah. what to do. <laughs> like, if we tried to do that ourselves, we'd probably, uh, we'd probably be I, here I, this I, time know, next week. Well, I mean, I, obviously, you you wouldn't know the mechanics, but I I think you know you'd you'd figure it out, right? Like nothing. The only really weird mechanic there is Rigam, right? You're like what what the fuck is that? You got to push him onto the boss. That that's unhinged, right? But other than that, it's not that bad. Uh, so, Makamer, it's time to break out your secret build that I know you've been, you've been ready, you've been saving just for this very moment. Have fun, buddy. Uh, <laughs> hand kite. <laughs> the, what I love, this is so funny. You'll, you'll always hand kite. You'll never get to play DPS. No one ever is going to do this shit. Oh, that's so funny. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Make sure you hit the bus. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, we also started the fight. Let's quickly GG. Yeah, be, stand on the edge here, right? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> it's, we, it's already over for us. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. definitely not first I, Honestly, I, died I'm, really I'm really impressed. I'm really impressed by that. I'm I'm so impressed. Like, if the chat isn't impressed by that, then fuck the chat. Seriously, I, I think that killing Sarog CM first try with never seeing the fight before. So we've been raiding. We've been raiding for less than a month. Yeah, our boy uh, Remo here has only been going for one day. Day one. 
Samrog CM. Giga Chad. One hour. And honestly, he was popping. He was 12k DPS. That's not horrible. We've got some room for improvement, obviously. He, the big dog here is blasting. He was partying hard on Sunday, but he was grinding the golem the next day. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm about. <laughs> like, yeah. Oh, we don't talk about Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, but I'm just going to reveal that. You know, I'm going to tell you know, so everyone's up to speed there. He, he was like, oh, I was partying too hard. Couldn't come to the boot camp on Sunday. I, like, he, was, he, was just, he was going berserk. Right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this would have been impossible on Sunday, I yeah. tell you. <laughs> Uh, okay. So, hmm, what do we want to talk about here? Um, uh, okay, here's the deal. We got the pre-event. Uh, actually, the best way to show this is to actually witness it. Uh, I think otherwise it's going to be weird. Uh, I will not explain the pre-event. I think we're going to do a lot of learning by doing here. Uh, <laughs> is what's about to happen. Okay. All right, three, two, one, I'm going in. So... Here's what's going to happen. Uh, oh, we don't need to worry about it yet, because uh, we're probably going to die. Um, so, green circle. Let's see what happens. Everyone get in there. Get in there. Let's see what happens. So, we go into the Ooh. shadow realm. This guy is here. If you get hit by this attack, you will get knocked off the edge and die. We've got to kill all four of these bonds. Watch out there, Victor. Yeah. Oh, Aegis carried you. How does it feel? You know, you got carried by a shield. Here comes another one. Watch out. Okay, so we've got to kill all four of those things to spawn the boss. Uh, so let's go ahead and see if we can do that. Now, while this is happening, you'll notice that the um, there's loads of these ads coming in um, to the center. They're actually damaging an NPC that we need to keep alive. As you can see, it's already taken a lot of health. This is technically speaking kind of a wipe condition. We've already kind of fucked up. However, it won't be relevant until later. So we just want to see if we... Oh, by the way, you can kill more than one at once. You can kind of split up and damage them all at the same time. And then you can tick them down with condies or just like put down pulsing attacks, right? But let's go ahead and uh, spawn the boss here. We didn't get knocked off the edge. That's a very good start. So kill this oh, thing. I like that we didn't get teleported. That's okay. Oh, no. Yeah, you don't need to. So here comes the boss. We get a nice cutscene. Now we should probably oh, disable no. that. Here he comes. The big dog. Ooh. Damn. Demos. Hands. Mm. Look at all those hands. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, that's that's a lot of hands. Yes, it is a lot of hands. There's a huge amount. Handsy with us. Yeah. And actually, speaking of which, basically, the reason why Makima reload there is because he is going to be basically doing nothing in this fight except running around in a okay. circle. Uh, so tanking here, you can just stand in the middle. It's, um, st face it away from us, basically. But who is tanking? It should be Cuspins, I think. Yeah, it is. So basically, just take a look at what Makam is doing right at the edge. Basically, his job is uh, hand spawn on the furthest person away that do, like, Omega damage. So his responsibility is basically standing over there and not putting them on us. That's, that's all he does. <laughs> Have fun uh, on this fight. And doing a great job of it so far. I love to see it. Uh, here, slam. He Basic slam really attack, damage? right? Um, no, no damage here. Yeah. Just, uh, just kiting. Basic slam attack, don't get hit. Now, we need an Aegis here. Use Aegis. Because basically that attack there is an Omega one shot. Um, and on challenge mode, on normal mode, you kind of, um, the NPC helps you and puts down a little bubble for you. On challenge mode, we have to block it. You cannot invulnerability it, you must block it. That's the only way to mitigate that damage. And afterwards you get a damage debuff, uh, sorry, a, a ticking damage debuff too that also hits you really hard. So we have to compensate for that by, well, healing, right? And using protection. So now we're going to get another green circle at 75. And this is the other kind of key mechanic that's happening here. Don't take the tank. Everyone else goes, though. So don't take the tank down. So move back a little bit and, um, yeah, get ready to use an Aegis. Use an Aegis just in case. Aegis. Uh. Okay, yeah. Uh, what you want to do there, because you're tanking, save shield five for that. So don't use that off cooldown for this fight. And now we have to fight these souls. This happens at 75. Um... 50 and 25. They all have different abilities. This guy, if we don't break his CC bar, he'll steal all of our boons, which definitely sucks. Second guy splits uh, into smaller ones, and the third guy teleports us around randomly, unless we break the defiance bar. It's a bit annoying. Oh, no. uh, oh hang on. Let's get that CC. Yeah. Try and CC the uh, CC soul. And now try and just cleave it down, guys. Cleave it down. You can actually move the boss over uh, to the soul here so we can kill it quickly, because otherwise we're going to get boon ripped. Oh boy, this is going to suck. Are we focusing on the boss? or uh, the Yeah. So basically we got boon ripped there because oh. we didn't kill the soul. We, yeah, ideally we want to we want to kill the soul. Uh, let's go ahead and reset because our hand guy died as well. Okay. 
Yeah. It's so yeah, we want to kill. Edge. We want to kill the soul <laughs> big time. Uh, ideally, what we do is we simply move over to it with the boss. We tank the boss um, over with the soul, or usually the soul will actually move to us. But because we actually broke its defiance bar right as it came back, it didn't move. Uh, so that's kind of like a weird thing. Also, these are markers, cuss beans, because right? I'm going to explain this mechanic now as well. Right now, you're probably thinking, wow, what a relaxing fight to tank. I'm not doing anything. Ah, here's the, here's the fun. Uh, so at 60%, this is probably one of the most legendary mechanics in all of Guild Wars 2. Uh, and if you've played WoW, I think you'll be familiar with this one, Mew, actually, because I think you've played WoW, and some of you guys have probably done it as well. Um, so a orange circle will spawn on the second closest person to the boss who isn't the tank. Uh, or rather, the closest person to the boss who isn't the tank. And after a few seconds, it will turn into a puddle of oil. It's basically the defile mechanic uh, from uh, Lich King, if you're familiar with that encounter. Uh, and if anyone stands in it, the AoE will grow insanely fast. Okay? Uh, and will essentially cover the entire platform. Do not stand in the oil. React, move. Fuck your DPS, doesn't matter. Leave. Do not go in. Do not teleport into the oil. Do not touch the oil in any way, right? Just don't do it. It's, it's just it's just not smart, okay? Three, two, one, go. Uh, why is Makima in subgroup three? Uh, because he uh, hates us. No, the actual answer uh, is because um, basically we actually don't want that player to be absorbing any boons. So we might as well have um, an open grouping, uh, an open position in group one so that that player can actually, so basically there's overflow. Now we can overflow our boons from group one into group two and healing much easier. Uh, because basically we're never going to really be interacting um, with Makama as it will simply be at the edge of the arena just having fun doing his own thing. Because whenever, so this attack, get, get right, see that, see this, your guilty conscious portrays you, sound cue, Aegis now. And then, pow, right? Okay. Oh, we need um, res on hand kite, uh, this is signet time, signet time on necro. Oh. Okay, we're, we're dead, we're dead, GG. We got yeeted. Just, uh, just reset, just hey, reset. What's just, just reset. Basically our hand kite had died, essentially. Uh, we did get the revive, but someone else died. And I, I want to actually get, I want to get deep into the fight. No, don't worry about it. Like you, you have the most annoying role. Uh, don't, you don't need to be sorry. <laughs> Uh, Just don't <laughs> fall asleep. <laughs> yeah. Get ready. The oil is coming up soon. So after this attack, cast means we want to go ahead and move out. Get that res. Res fast. Res fast. Okay. See these uh, white circles, by the way, guys? Just when you see one of those, move out and grab it. That's a demonic tear. Uh, that thing will just like spam us with like random damage unless we, um, you know, unless we do the thing. Okay. Oil is coming. Get ready to move. Don't get knocked off the edge. Oil, run, out, 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 out. Don't touch that, don't touch that. Okay, we actually succeeded. That's what it looks like. So even when it's orange, don't stand in it. Makama, you want to swap sides. Okay. Basically, you want to be wherever we aren't, is your rule. Oil, move, oh. move, move, move. Okay. Take the green, and then remember, save shield five, um, Cuspins. Everyone else, get in there. Oh, uh, save your F2. You need to use your F2, Cuspins, to save red when the Aegis comes through. Yeah, so don't use F2. Say, use that to save him. So this guy splits into little thingies. Oh, yeah, we, no, we completely we failed. Cares, right? It's okay, we can maybe try and go I'm back. Dead. I'm dead. Yeah, I, hang on, let's let's get through this. I, I will tank just so we can see a little bit more of the fight. Because um, I, I should be able to take over a little bit. Okay, try and finish this uh, off now. Try and finish these. Oh, grab the tears, grab those tears. And just restack, restack. Yeah, the skull means that you've taken a tear, means you can't take another one. All right, get in position, get in position. Oh, that's a really shitty overlap. Oh, nice. We achieved it. Get out, get out, get out, get out. So now the soul is uh, split again. So we need to kill the uh, real one again. Basically, the one that has... Don't touch the oil. Oh, my. The good Mew, good what was that movement? Good also, good. Wh what? That was very strange <laughs> movement. Know. Okay. That was very strange. I need to... I almost like to see like your key presses. There's some really weird stuff going on with how you're um, moving. Okay. No. We GG. That was very strange. <laughs> Um, that, that looked like keyboard turning to me. It looked very keyboard turny. That is... Uh, trackboard, isn't it? Yeah, don't... Well, I, I don't know. Are you? What? Do not enable... Wait, yes? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, yes, good. That, that, yeah, that is catastrophic. You, you're going to have a lot, a lot of trouble with that. <laughs> you're playing on, like, giga hard right, mode, right? Like, you... you... <laughs> 
Like you're playing on like Omega hard mode. Like, <laughs> then honestly, this guy, he, he's got such a big ego. He's like, dude, this boss is too easy. I'm going to crank it up by playing on a trackpad. Like, like, <laughs> Good. Oh, uh, port, 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 port. We can save you. Uh, what, what you might find useful there, uh, by the way, um, everyone, is you. The boss slams at the front, and then the attacks kind of like sh uh, shockwave out to the back. So uh, watch my. If you watch, okay, w dodge through the boss like this, right? Yeah. If you dodge, if you kind of watch what I'm doing here, I'm here. I'm dodging through the boss. That will really help make that timing a lot easier to nail. Okay, get ready for the oil. Grab the white circle, grab the tear. You can only grab one every couple of mo uh, every like minute or so, so we kind of have to, you know, all share the response. Oil, move out of the oil and Aegis. Out of the oil and Aegis. Yeah. Oil, oh, Ralph, you're out of the oil. Yeah, and by the way, backpedaling yeah, out is here, not yeah. good enough. You can't backpedal yeah. there. It's not good enough to backpedal. You have to turn your character. It's, it's fine, we're actually okay. We're okay. The next slam is going to be awkward. Use an Aegis if we can. Here comes the slam. Okay. Oil, 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 oil. The big one's gone. Move out of that oil. Move out of that oil. Move to heart. Move to heart. Just run to heart. We're, we're chilling. We're chilling. We're not in a rush here. Um, but DPS is not that relevant. Like, we're perfectly relaxed here. Aegis, Aegis, Aegis. Res quickly, and then there's going to be a green circle. Oil. Move out of that oil. Dodge the slam. Regroup. Let's regroup. Restack and just start damaging the boss again. We're fine. We're totally chill. Okay, good. And now just survive, um, Cuspins, as much as you can. So remember, this guy splits up. Okay, advanced tech here. If we get the one-shot attack while Saul is split, dodge right before the one-shot attack. The reason for that is because this guy can remove our Aegis. It's a real pain in the ass. This guy is number This guy is number one priority. Delete this guy as hard as possible. All focus on this Saul when we get back. All focus on him. Fuck the boss, kill the Saul. Nuke him. If we can kill him before he splits, we're unbelievably happy. It's a little tricky, but let's see if we can pull it off. We actually got it. Nice. Really good. Now back on the boss. Oh, the tank's oh. down. Oh, uh, I will continue. I will continue. <laughs> we'll continue. I want to see more. Ah, uh, right. Now, 40%, guys. Notice that um, now we have pride spawning. So now we have to also cleave the pride. So all people with cleave, cleave these things down. Because oh. otherwise they will get to the middle and kill us. Try to mobilize it if we can. Okay, and 25%. Hmm, we don't really have enough for sacrifice right now. Well, if, if we get oil, or move out of the oil guns. Get the fuck out, get the fuck out. Oh boy, yeah, okay. Uh, no, yeah. Uh, we're dead here. No. We're dead, we're dead. Yeah. Yeah, you've got to get out of that oil, guys. I always, bear in mind, it starts orange. Right? It starts orange. Get those tears, get those demonic tears, gamers. Remember, 25%, you're going on your own. You're on your own. Oil, and get ready to move. Move. Oh, we failed Aegis. Get the reses, get the reses. Get the reses. We're okay, we're okay, we're okay. We can make it work. We're okay, we're okay. Heal up, heal up. Okay, so red, run away. Do not take us. Go on your own, go on your own. And everyone regroup. Oil, heart, 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 heart. Okay, we're just, so if you went up, it's fine. If you went up, it's okay. Just uh, try and survive. Heal each other and try and survive. Wait, hang on, wait. W w were you, you're Firebrand, right? Do we just lose a Firebrand? That's okay. Um, go to Arrow, go to oil. Arrow. Get out, get out that oil. Okay, stack up here. I think we're okay, I think we're okay. This is doable. Just keep pushing the DPS. Play safe, play safe. Hold on as long as you can, Red. Hold on as long as you can. Spam that heal skill. Hold on, hold on. We're going to be up pretty soon. We're nearly there. Keep this up, gamers. 7%. We just got to use 7%. Oil is going to be spawning. Ready for oil. Oil. Move to heart. Get that pride. Kill that pride, guys. I'm down. That's okay. It's okay. Oh, you can even vengeance to delay even longer. Actually, no. Uh, yeah, yeah, you might as well, actually. Like vengeance if you can. Yep. One shot. Get this Aegis, guys. Oil. Move out of that oil and Aegis. 1%. Okay, Saul is going to come here, guys. We can actually kill him, I think. Okay, Saul's going to come here. Blast him when he comes down. We can probably even kill him. It should happen basically now. Or maybe not, actually. Do we pick up these tears? Oh, that's annoying. Oh, yeah, I guess it, it's not going to happen. Uh, don't pick these up. Pick them up when we go up. Don't pick any tears here. Right. 
The boss is going to go crazy. Uh, pick up these tears. Just run towards the boss. Run towards the boss. He's giant. Uh, Firebrands use stability here. Also, Cuspeans use stability. The animations here suck. Just try not to die. Souls on us. Just cleave him down. And just spam stability and Aegis as hard as possible. Okay, if you get ported, run back to the boss. Just stay together. Get to the tag. And just nuke the living hell out of the boss. Come on, let's go. Demos is 8%. Wait, 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 we need hand kiting here, by the way. We do need hand kiting. We do still need hand kiting. We are not hand kiting. Uh, whoops. CC the soul. Oh, no, that's bad. Oh, no, wait, despawn. It's fine. Move to the other side with me. Follow the tag. Follow the tag with me, with me, with me. And just keep DPSing the boss. It's 4%. And move out of that oil. Oh, boy. <laughs> Get back in there. Just range it down. Range Demos. 2%! Kill it! Yes! Let's go! Let's go, guys! Let's yes. go! Let's go. That is... And Perfect look how much it, you get loads of... Okay, you might be thinking, whoa, we got so many achievement points there. Um, the, these achievements were actually bugged. There was a way to get them kind of by cheating. So they actually made the oh. same achievement twice uh, with the different titles. You just got two titles. You got Demon's Demise. Uh, and what's the other one, actually? Um... It's Demon's Demise and... I can't remember what it's... Oh, Silent Savior. Yeah, Silent Savior and Demon's Demise. And we get loads of AP for that. So there you go. That is Wing 4 Full Challenge Mode completed. That, by the way, so the way everyone's aware of that. That is first try. Um, oh, sorry. No normal mode. We skipped normal <laughs> yeah. mode. It's not first try. Definitely but it, yeah, first try, It's guys, not but... first try, but it is actually normal mode skipped entirely. We only did challenge mode. I'm very tempted to actually do that uh, with all of the fights from now on. I think that could actually be really fun. Um, but there you go. I mean, I'm dead. Yes. I have a question. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. question. yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Uh, so at twenty five percent, when you get the solo circle thing, can you avoid going up, or you just you just accept your fate? You basically accept your fate. Um, the the dream scenario there is that you actually survive long enough that we get the ten percent, and when we improve our damage, we will be able to do that. Um, essentially, the re it's 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 still better that you sacrifice yourself there because flat out it just makes the kill kind of locked in. If we can get to ten percent, we kind of win. Um. Uh, but yeah, you basically accept your fate. Yeah, you, you, yeah. you basically accept your fate, uh, ultimately, and just try and hold on for as, as long as possible. Do I have to do anything specific or nope. just survive? run around in circles for as long as you can and just survive as or long as possible. Survive. Yep, that's it. That is the deal. Yeah, oh yeah, we get the portable magnetite shard exchange. That's kind of nice, isn't it? We can buy things wherever we are now. Nice. That's kind of cool. Uh, but yeah, yeah, uh, that's that's Wing 4. God, that is so impressive, seriously. Well done, gamer. That's so good. We've been raiding for a month, and we've already... I think we're actually very high level. You know what? I think I will say we're going to do everything on challenge mode uh, from now on. I believe that we have the ability to do that. We have the ears to do that. I think we have the mechanics to do that. That was very impressive. This is pretty big, you know? I, I have to say, just on a personal level, if I can speak for myself here, um, the boot camp is doing exactly what I'd hoped that it is, it is supposed to do, right? It's supposed to show people what can be done, right? When, um, when we put in effort, basically, to p put it simply, right? We're putting in a lot of work. We're doing it for the team, right? We're working as a team. We're in it for the team. Mm -hmm. And we are annihilating. We're in it to win it. We are in it to win it. We are crushing everything in our path. And hopefully soon we have 10. I won't be able to leech anymore. Actually, I'm pretty sad about that. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, that's uh, that's it. Okay. Hell yeah. Yeah, very well played there, and that's incredibly impressive. Uh, we've come such a long way in such a short period of time, uh, and, you know, we're accelerating. That's what I like about this. We're getting better and better. We're, the rate of improvement is increasing, and that's what I like to see. That's what we all like to see. But, yeah, Demos CM now clear. That's a hard fight. You know, that fight can definitely be punishing, and uh, really good work on everyone who practiced your damage output, by the way, guys. It's, it's really come on really nicely in, in just, you know, less than a week, of course. Um, it, it's really, really come along a lot actually. So really well done there. Great job on that <coughs> practice. Again, we should continue to try and uh, practice and improve, of course. Again, always feel free to, you know, uh, give me a message or give Nika a message and, and we can help you with that, no problem. Uh, but yeah. Oh yeah. Very, very good. Very, very good stuff indeed. Very well played.